So it came yesterday, <clears throat> teamed up with Matt, and we hadn't got an idea and eventually thought something to do. So we've made a very simple app, it's iOS native. Um, we decided that the most of the problem is every other hotel site you use, it's pretty much text driven. So we thought we'd take advantage of tablet, touch, and some hopefully fluid UI if the Wi-Fi holds up. Um, and we'd make something that was a bit more interactive. And so this allows you to just, it's all the hotels that Expedia have returned into London, and then you could say, well, I only want one with a business center. And they'll gradually grow as you narrow your fitness. So I want to do some fitness and go to the gym and do some business, but no, not really. I'll just do some fitness. You can click on the hotel. You would get the TripAdvisor rating and every other bit of data we could parse out of um, Expedia's API. And then what's it like in the local area? So we've now connected to Flickr and found <laughs> good hotel. Um, we found local pictures that is the closest we can find to that hotel. <laughs> We haven't sanity checked any of these pictures. Um, <laughs> they're completely random. <laughs> so to find out which hotel that was, you can simply click back. So that's the Strand Place. Um, you might want to go somewhere else, depending if you're impressed with that or not. Um, then you can, you should be able to go back, but the app appears to have stuck. So obviously those photos have overheated the iPad. So thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, Haka Hotel.